So in the last demo, we showed how to operate a linear actuator with just basic direct movement in or out. In this demo, we're showing you how to make use of the potentiometer that's inside this for positional feedback in order to do positional adjustments and movements. So as you can see at the end of the cable here that's coming from the linear actuator, we've got it split out. You have two um, for power, so you have your positive and negative that go to the motor for power, and then you have three other colored wires, which are your potentiometer. Now the color of the wire is going to be determined by which linear actuator you bought and from where. It's going to be different in every case. You'll have to look at the data sheets to figure out how to properly wire them up. But they wire to an analog input into your shield or your Arduino. So now we have positional feedback because we have a value from an analog sensor inside that's going to tell you where the shaft is at any given moment. So now we can operate our relays to drive the shaft in or out while reading that value in order to send it to a specific position. So on our workbench here, we've got two buttons again for input, our two relays out, and we have our geek Duino here in the center. And the code is really simple. Basically, I've uh, hard-coded a position to each one of these buttons. So when you hit a button, the code sees that you're setting a new goal position. It takes a look at what the current position is on the analog sensor, and then determines whether it needs to send uh, the motor this way to go up or this way to go down. And then it's reading from there, and when it hits the goal position, it just shuts everything down. That's really all the code is doing. So you can see here, if I hit the buttons, it's going to go out until it hits a goal position. It's going to shut everything down. I can hit the other button, which goal position is in. Draws it in and stops. And it's that simple. So that's how to control a linear actuator using the potentiometer for positional uh, feedback. And hope you have fun with it. Thanks.